This is cool, Dodge City, Dallas. Car was sold here locally. Cool. Alex, we may have actually finally found a survivor that doesn't have to be from every store. <laughs> yeah. All right, good morning, team. Morning. Morning. Good morning. Thanks for waking up so early. Yeah. You know why we're here so early? It's supposed to be 104 degrees today. Fantastic. Mm. So it's 6.45 in the morning, and we're going to go rescue two cars that are relatively close. They're in Garland, Texas. I've only seen one picture, and the reason we're taking two ramps and two single trailers is I think it's going to be difficult to get the big trailers where we're going. Not that it's in the middle of nowhere, but you're going to see it when we pull up to the house. 69 Charger. One family owned since new that has been in the garage since 1979. Oh, wow. And the main reason you're coming, Connor, mm -hmm. is because it's incredibly dusty and dirty. We need help pushing it. <laughs> but you got floor jack, right? Yeah, I do. It's like shoved against a wall on four flat tires. Oh, wow. So it's packed cool. in there. And next to it is a 71 Corvette. So I think we're going to call this the family rescue because here's how it went down. They had to talk each other into selling their cars. Oh. And they both had to sell their cars at the same time, or neither one was going to sell their cars. They actually want their garage back. So let's go rescue these two killer American muscle cars. So grab your cup of joe and let's go. Good morning, Dad. How are you? Good. How are you doing? Good. Morning, Zach. Morning. Morning, Alex. Look at that. House number 13. That's our family's lucky number. Sure is. You know how new is that house? How? A minivan in the driveway. Are we getting a minivan today? Maybe. <laughs> you know me, I'll buy anything if the price is right. <laughs> so they're, they're going to meet us here at 730. Okay. And it's uh, 725. It's amazing how smoothly things are going today. You James? Yes, sir. Hi, Dennis Collins. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, sir. This is Zach. Hello. Alex, Alex, Kelsey, Hi, Kelsey. Connor, Hi, and James. How you doing, sir? So I brought plenty of horsepower. Yeah, you're going to need them. We're going to need them? Okay. Yeah, it's going to be fun. So how long has the door been stuck? Uh, I don't think the door's been off in 20 years. Sweet. 20 years. You know what, James? What? See there? I'm glad you're here. <laughs> I'm glad I'm here. Too. He's an expert at doors. He doesn't want to be, but he is. I know that. Right. <laughs> we got a lot of doors at Calls Brothers, don't we? We do. On this side, I think okay. it's one side. Well, tell us what you want us to do. We'll get after it. I'm just start moving some of this crap, I guess. Okay. Misty. Misty. All right. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Hi, Dennis Collins. I know who you are. Who okay. Yeah. It's my daughter Kelsey. Hi, Sam. Good morning, Misty. Nice to meet you. She does the paperwork. Oh, awesome. So you said the door hadn't been opened in about 20 years, so it might be interesting. Uh, that door it. hadn't been opened probably probably longer than that. Longer than that? <laughs> that okay. car's been in there since 77, 78, something like that. It's been there since 77 or 78? Wow, yeah. outstanding. Yeah, yeah it's... Success. Yeah. What nobody going to steal that car? Right? <laughs> <laughs> so it's been sitting somewhere between 77 and 79. I guess we'll find that. I only saw one picture of it and it looks like it is incredibly dusty and dirty. I don't even know how it got that dusty and dirty. Well, he said he does woodworking on it. That would make sense. Yes, it would, wouldn't it? Is there a car in there? Uh, it looks like it. Okay. <laughs> you need a flashlight? Hey, Alex. I hope you don't because I don't have one. You know that. <laughs> There's no way anybody could even get in here because this door. It's sealed shut right there. It wouldn't even open. So I guess there's no way these cars are going to get stolen out of here, huh? Not that side. <laughs> they could have cracked inside this one and maybe stole the vet out. But... Well, this is there. They won't be able to get that. No. Two more screws. Look, James, I got plug. Oh, you got a light. Where you go next? I see you. <laughs> How do you spell that? R-U-B-B-L-E. Rubble? Rubble. Like as in Barney? 
<laughs> there you go. All right, you ready? I'm going to pull back on the door as you start the bend. Oh, my God. Wow. And the crypt is open. Okay. Way to go, James. That's outstanding. Thank you, sir. There you go. Thank you. It was a little. It was a little bit of a. Definitely. I sure am glad I brought a bunch of people today. Yes, sir. It was a good idea. We're going to need them. It was a good idea. So I woke up this morning and decided I was going to be a shot caller today. Shot caller. Kind of like a supervisor. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> supervisor. That's why you make the big bucks. <laughs> Where's Connor? Come on, man. <laughs> Did we lose him? We lost him. Hanging out back. <laughs> Well, I blame, blame my brothers for stealing that air tank. Uh-oh, and there it is. Now they know. They're off, they're off the hood. There you go. Oh, perfect. Fender tags here, original course ports in it, power steering, power brakes. Hmm. You know what, Ox, I know that you really like to be the first one to check out the serial number, so... Oh, thanks for that. <laughs> okay, where can we pile the wood? Can we just, just put it to anywhere. the side? Yeah, yeah, just anywhere. All right. Let me see how many pairs of gloves we got. What year is that? 84. Very cool. Dallas Cowboys, 1984, 25 years in the National Football League. Look at that, Kels. That's, that's really cool. This car really has been in here since the 70s. Yes. Wow. Yep. I think the last time it was registered was 78. Look at that. I've maintained those damn A pull top can. Do you even know if that is, Alex? <laughs> no, I don't. Alex has never seen the pull top can. <laughs> Look at that car. I'm sorry. Like when you pulled it. Yeah. I stepped on the video pull top. beer. <laughs> Alex, look at this hitting in the corner. It's like camouflaged. Look what I found too. Look at that. You Matching found one. I found one. Uh, this is a good sign. The VIN number is always stamped on the core support. Colors match, so be willing to bet that this is going to match that. As you look there on the trim tag, Let's see if it does. And it does. So you've got a 2802012802. Original course board, at least, Alex. Yeah. <laughs> as long as this car's been sitting, I sure hope it's original motor. <laughs> Probably down on the other pad. Watch this. Are you ready for this? Yeah. The flashlight. Wow. It's not quite clean enough to read. Just so <laughs> much scrape it off of it. All right, so here's the kicker. Get over there, Alex, and we'll see what the, what the VIN tag says. All right. It's an elk good. 444 barrel. 375 horse. That's cool. That's what we want to see. Yeah. What is the uh, first letters of the is it XP? XS. It's even better. So we're uh, RT. Obviously RT right here because it's hitting the headlights. And then according to Vin, it's also an SE. So it'd be RT SE. RT SE. Mm -hmm. Outstanding. And it's a uh, it's a Y3 color. That's yeah, and it's actually Y3. cream. I did a lot of yeah. research on that. They it's actually a pretty rare color. Those cars are actually painted the Y3 yellow. Look at the color of the dash. So, so it's the bronze. Bronze, bronze dash, so it's probably got tan interior then. Yeah, it's got a bronze dash, or that. bronze <laughs> Yeah, I did the van on it before, and it said... Yeah, let's look at the seats. I bet... The, that's tan. Oh, 
console, wood grain inserts. Our tan interiors. Yes, tears tan. So I think that color up there. Uh, that, Some of that stuff is just the the dash is painted. I think it's bronze. Yeah. It's kind of an offset color. Is it vinyl top? It's vinyl top car too. Wow. You know what would be cool? If we did a mod top on this car. I agree. I can't even imagine who would have had that idea. <laughs> but I agree. A mod top would be neat. Check this out. Yep. RTSE. This is a really nicely option car. Strike delete car too, so it's got the full metal bag in the back. That's neat. That Favorite part? Yeah, that's one of the coolest styling cues in the car for sure. And this is where they rust and it looks good. Oh no way. What? KZW sticker. Kelsey. What's one of my favorite jackets that I wear that mom does not like at all? Uh, that band one? K yeah, KZW. KZW. <laughs> Over here. Oh, the sticker? Yeah, one of my favorite radio that stations. Look at that. You know mom's going to think that's why you bought the car. Right? <laughs> yeah. Jonathan said you'd like that sticker. Look at I that. love it. Look at that. KZW. That's awesome. That is staying on there. Uh, all right, now. It's got a Z sticker on it? Yes, sir, it does. That's awesome. Is it the flying elephant? The license plate's not on it. That front plate on the front, though, looked to me like it was a 75 plate. This is cool. Dodge City, Dallas. Car was sold here, luckily. Cool. Alex, we may have actually finally found a survivor. That doesn't have to be from the store. <laughs> yeah. cool. Love the RT badge back there, too. Is there an inspection sticker up there? So when you had a strike delete car, Alex, yeah. you had this killer badge. You had a killer with a strike delete. Unbelievable. That's really, really, really a badge. Alex, I think you missed this. Oh, it's got one. Inspection sticker is a 19. Looks like 75. I know it's not a 76 because the 76 ones were, you know, bicentennial sticker. So I think that's a 75 sticker. Wow. That's been parked for a long time. So this car was only on the road for six years. We've got to be able to clean this thing up. Um, suggestion. What's that? I think we should jack it up a little bit to get a little bit of pressure off so make sure the tires do seal. Okay. Instead of just trying it right here. Let's see if we can get a jack it in front of it. Just get a little, get it up in the air and see if they're air up. But now I've got to look at the Corvette real quick. Actually, we haven't bought them yet, so uh -oh. <laughs> we need to figure that out. All right, 71 Corvette. Yeah. How long has this one been sitting, James? Uh, whatever that sticker says, right? Okay. Interior's in it, but rough. Automatic. Yes, sir. T-top car. It's not the original motor. Is it just a small block 350? Yeah, just 350. You can pop the hood if you want. So this has been sitting since 08. And I think that may be the cedar, and I think it was actually seven. 2006 was last inspection. Yeah. So let's so go with let's go with 2006. Maybe it's been since 2005. Yeah. Motor may mo, motor may have 17 years. Maybe 10,000 miles on it. Now, and this is your car? Yeah. This is your wife's car? Yes, sir. Okay. So we got two different deals going on here. And uh, here. They've decided to clean their garage out, but the deal is both of them had to sell their cars. So we got to buy both of them. Yep. I'll buy 71 Corvettes all day long. Now I don't have a problem with that. I love 69 Chargers. Me too. Okay, ma'am, you got a deal. I'm going to pay you what we discussed on the phone. Awesome. Thank you. Love the car. Now I got to go see if he's going to turn loose the Corvette, right? Oh, he's going to turn loose that Corvette. Yeah, see there? <laughs> he'll, he'll, the let loose. he'll let loose. He'll let loose. All right, James. I like the Corvette. Awesome. And I'm going to pay you what we discussed on the phone. Awesome. Deal? Deal. All yes, right. Sir. Now, Kelsey and your wife will do the paperwork and let's get after it, Alex. Let's get them out and on the trailer and back to Wiley. Corvette or the Charger first? We do the hard one or the easy one? I say we do the hard one.
is. Really? Rally gauges with a tick-tock tack? Nope, never seen it. How cool is that? Wow. And it's got a good set in the car. Keys are in it, cool. the steering wheel's unlocked, the car's in neutral, and I got the emergency brake off, so I'm done. You're killing it. Enough. So we said we could have these. Got the Coke bottle. Full top Budweiser can. These cars have been in the garage for a long time. That's a big piece we almost left. That way we won't have to paint the other hood. We're gonna have to put this on Alex, I think. All right, I'll see you sell the back of our strap across it. Um, well, James, thanks for the Corvette. You bet. Outstanding. A really good day. We appreciate you being a caretaker of these fine machines. And we have a restaurant that we've been wanting to eat at. We always ask the people who buy cars from where their favorite place is. But this has been recommended to us by a ton of people. And we haven't had a buy in Garland we've been waiting for. It. So we're going to go to Hubbard's Cupboard. It's pretty good. Okay. If you'd like to join us, it's on me. No, I'm good, man. Okay. I'll wait for my wife to get off work. Outstanding. Well, thanks again. Thanks a ton for your time. Oh, Pleasure you to meet you. All right. Have a great day. I'm not shy, I'll go first. Perfect. Okay, it looks to me that since it's the most expensive thing on the menu, the Hubbard Sampler's gotta be the way to go. Oh, absolutely. Mm. Okay. It's good. And it's a little bit of everything, so. I want a little bit of everything. Great. So, so like your eggs. Uh, over easy. Okay. And I'll do half waffle, okay. half French toast, and then hash browns cooked crispy. You want a half waffle and a half a piece of, like, what? You, you he choose two. He, he wants a you little of everything. You can choose a half a waffle? Yeah. You can, that's right, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and then it comes with one bacon, one ham, and one sausage. Is that okay? Absolutely. Perfect. And then, for my dessert, <laughs> I want a cinnamon roll. Sure. I think we only have one left. Oh, it put does my have, name on it. It does have pecans. Can you pick them off? I'll pay you extra to pick them. Outstanding. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> if you want uh, your meal or a Difficult later. order. Um, I think you can bring it with it. That'd be cool. Yeah, sure. Can you heat it up yeah, too man. and put butter on top? Oh, absolutely. Perfect. I've been thinking right. about that cinnamon roll all week. Uh, yeah. and they're Do we need to go over there and get it right now before somebody steals it? I'll go, I'll go over after I'm done and I'll okay. for you. Okay, very good. James. Yeah. Sampler. Okay. Over easy. Okay. French toast. Uh, hash browns crispy. Okay. So yeah. does that mean you're doing a quarter of French toast? You're not doing a half quarter of French toast? Just the way it comes. Did you want There's all three choices. of the meats? Huh? All three of the meats are okay? Yes, ma'am. Perfect. And could I have a side of gravy, please? Absolutely. 
outstanding for the diet. And this is Madison. She's yeah. training, so she's taking orders with everyone. Hi, Madison. Hey. For you? Um, I'm gonna do the same thing that he got, okay. but um, my eggs, eggs are gonna be Okay. Hot from crispy. Madison, this is the perfect table to train on. <laughs> <laughs> And over easy sampler. Right, a little bit of everything there. Yes, scrambled hash brown. Of course, and here's some hot sauce I've brought for down here, and for y'all as well, we're bringing some. A box of hot sauce. That is a thick cut piece of bacon. Would you like that crispy piece of bacon? Thank you. <laughs> okay. So we're still waiting on the French toast, cinnamon roll, and half a waffle, but that's okay. Holy plate. Alrighty, I've got a cinnamon roll with most of the pecan straight off. Outstanding. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Look Two at that. Breakfast with looks like bacon a proper and hash roll. browns. Thank you. Sampler over easy eggs, hash browns crispy. That was supposed to have been mine. She put someone else wait, down. Wait, 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 what, what you got? Was over easy crispy. Oh, I, I oh, think okay. I James, I got the size. Huh? This one's you got mine. Scrambled. James, James's is Alex's. Yeah. 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 And you have habanero salsa. Thank you. You bet. And then half French toast. Thank you. Half a waffle. Oh no, this is the toast. Regular toast. Kelsey. Thank you. Half French toast as well. That's only a, that's a half a French toast. <laughs> yes, sir. Wow. Okay. Half a waffle. Yeah. I think I got my bread group down today. <laughs> you got all the carbs. <laughs> your carb loads. Yes. I'm gonna start off with. Uh, hmm. I think I got this right off the bat. Thank you. We're gonna have a Is little bit of cinnamon roll. Else we can get that looks outstanding so far. I'll get a tea picture and come back around. Okay? So I got hot melted butter on the cinnamon roll. I need to get some sausage with that. Change the taste a little bit. Get a little bit of egg on it. A little egg on your face. <laughs> so this has got to be the best buy of the day for sure. Sausage cinnamon roll, over easy egg, outstanding. Well, that was outstanding. Just what I was craving. And that's why we got up so early, so we could eat early and have a great meal. What a great day to be alive. We saved a 69 Charger RTSE. It's been in the garage since 1977. So it was only on the road for eight years. I think we figured out why I was in the garage though. We did. It's got a little hemi dent in the front. <laughs> but we can fix it. We got an awesome set of tools back at the shop. And then a cool 71 Corvette. And an incredible meal at Hubbard's. So what a great day. Please like, tag, share, and follow. And remember, we actually have a TikTok now. But most importantly, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you next week.